So we're leaving a little parking spot where we've parked up for the night. Um, and it was a lovely little spot, very quiet in the village. Uh, with all the amenities, somewhere to empty the loo, toilets, water, grey waste. It had it all going on. Croissants and pain chocolate. Yeah, as you know, we had those for breakfast. And um, we're continuing south. The sun is shining and we've got about an hour and a half to two hours drive to Lyon and uh, it's going to be a nice drive. So we are going out for the afternoon yeah. with Vera, with Vera. Who, is, who is an old friend of ours who lived with us for a while in the UK about 20 years ago. And in those days we thought it was hilarious to call her Hello Vera because you know Hello <laughs> Vera. Vera. We used to go Hello Vera. Yeah really and funny. It was very funny. <laughs> I didn't know about yeah. And we are um, with Vera's friend, who I'm not sure I can pronounce the name, Amandine. 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 Yes. Is that right, Amandine? Yes. And we're going into the city of Lyon, and uh, they're going to show us around, aren't you, Vera? Yes. And the sun is shining. It's a beautiful day, but the sun always shines on us. And Aww. Vera has very kindly, as the sun is shining, let us use her washing machine. Yeah. So, so far since we left England a couple of months ago, we have managed to get washing at everybody's houses and we haven't had to use a washing machine in a laundrette. Yes. Good you. job. Thanks, Vera. Thank you. You're welcome. So we've parked up on the outskirts of Lyon and we're going to get the tram in. Yep. So there's a tram system that, uh, that operates throughout Lyon. So Vera's going to show us how to get the tram. Okay, so you have the different fares here, really expensive for the city. Then you have a screen here with different choices. Yeah. <laughs> One ticket and you have different tickets. You have 24, got hours. 24 hours, 24 hours, 48. So if you buy a one hour ticket, you can go on and off as many times as you want in an hour. Exactly. Yes. Hello. Are you having fun? We're having a wonderful time. <laughs> Hello, Vera. Hello, Miriam. <laughs> we love Vera. We actually haven't seen Vera for nine years, and before that, it was um, another 11 years. So we met Vera 20 years ago. We had only been married 20, 23 years. So we'd only been married for two years. Oh. And Vera Boys, because they were out of control. All three of them. And were they were they well behaved? Yes, of course. Of course. <laughs> I paid good money for that answer. <laughs> One of the cool things is the ticket for the tram works on the subway or on the bus, so it's valid on all of them in Lyon. That's really cool. So we've taken a car from yeah. Vera's house, yeah. a tram, a, a subway metro train, yeah. and then like a cliff railway train, yeah. and now we're waiting for a bus. But more importantly, more importantly Vera's never been here before and she never. doesn't know where we're going. Where are we going? To Kofia, but I don't know where we should take the bus. Oh, okay. Should so we we, we're not really sure where we're going. Just here. Oh, there's a bus right yeah. here. 
You have to see where all the tourists are. So now we're are. taking a bus. Just follow the other tourists. So Vera's just told us that there's a very important day on the, t on the 8th of December and every year um, in Lyon they put up lights and candles and it's called the Town of Light um, because in history um, when France was suffering from the plague Lyon was actually protected and everybody, tradition states that it was actually the Virgin Mary that protected uh, Lyon and the surrounding towns and they pay tribute every year on the 8th of December and this is where the big statue of the Virgin Mary is just up on the building behind me. So the building behind us where the Virgin Mary statue is is called Notre Dame de Fourvière and it's um, right at the top of town of Lyon and this is where we're going to have our first monument to visit in the town. So we're now inside the Basilica Notre Dame Fourvière and in 1870 the Prussians that were invading into France, uh, the people of Lyon made a vow to God that if they were spared the invasion they would indeed build a bigger church um, and they vowed that they would do this if they were saved and spared from the invasion of the Prussians. So when they were not, weren't invaded, they created this and that's why it's called a basilica and not a cathedral. I've noticed in every city we go to, they have brass plaques on the tourist trails and uh, Actually, the same as every city we've been to, they have these here. They, except for here, they've got roses, brass plaques of roses on the floor. So if you're looking for an aerial view of Lyon, head up to the Basilica and just behind you will see the most breathtaking views and with sunshine like it is today, it's even better. It's then, a long way. Yeah, it's a very long staircase. Um, so if you're fit and healthy, go for it. But even walking down, it's quite a lot it's of pressure. It's a long way. It's a lot of pressure on your knees. I'd get the bus if I was you. <laughs> It's a group of chefs it's, and... Yeah, uh, it's an elite club that you have to be a member and proven that you are a top chef to be able to have this on your restaurant. So it means, if you see this, it should be a good restaurant. We've also been informed and we're expecting a lot of comments from all over France that Lyon, in fact, <laughs> it's been pulled up on Google. Lyon is the center, the gastronomic center of France. Of it's the France. capital, it's the food capital of France. And there are loads of lovely little restaurants as you walk around. UNESCO status for food. Yeah. It's Amazing. Let's go eat. <laughs> <laughs> Amazing. So behind this unassuming door, there is actually a passageway which we're going to walk through in a minute. It links four buildings. It was also used during the war um, to move stuff and people. So we're going to go and have a look. There are various passageways dotted around the city, but this is one that we've just to come across. This town is also, this city is also the birthplace of the resistance. So you can imagine maybe they actually used one of these tunnels. So let's go and have a little look. It's got, it's very atmospheric. 
atmospheric and um, it's bizarre because there are four buildings that are linked through this passageway and everybody is, um, people live here, you can see above me, there's people's homes and yet they've opened them up, it's um, an agreement that's been signed in the city and they've opened them up to allow people to walk through, how absolutely wonderfully generous of them, because these are people's houses. <laughs> So it's an almond. So it's a is, is, uh, it's famous in uh, Lyon. Yeah. yeah, you do lots of pastries with, uh, with that as well. With proline. Yeah. And it's uh, almonds with sugar. Sugared almonds. Okay. Oh, very nice. Very sweet almonds covered in sugar. Yeah. Nice. Mm. Not that dissimilar from sugared almonds in England. Yeah. yeah. But they look different, don't they? Because they're a completely different. They're a completely different look. Yes, they are soft. Than, oh, they're, they're soft. soft. Yeah, they're soft. Ah, because okay. it's the old way to do pies. Oh, the original way. Yes, the best. The, the be best of way. course. Of the world. Of the world. I love it. Beautiful. Vera and Armandine have told me that this town has become a little bit more touristy, but we find it really lovely because it's got cobbled streets, there's lots of little boutique shops, uh, local delicacies, and yeah, there's the tourist aspect to it, but it's a really nice uh, place. Have busy, look, it's busy. Yeah, it's busy, and have a look at these streets. pedestrianized square in Europe no comments below because we checked Google and Google is our friend Google is our friend <laughs> <laughs> Pedestrian Square has a function today. There's a function on the largest pedestrian square, so we can't really see it because it's behind us. So, but I don't know if you can pick it up on the camera, but there are trails from the aeroplanes over this square. So we've woken up in the van, and, and there are some people in the van, <laughs> and they've brought us breakfast they've walked down to the van in the rain to give in us breakfast and we've got croissant and croissant with praline that was the deep brioche à la praline oh brioche à la, oh, la, la praline that's what you wanted to oh, try oh this is the one famous in yeah. this area mm -hmm. yeah pain au chocolat Ooh. Ooh, and more i think we're going to be spoilt and bread ruben mm. oh now he's shy <laughs> <laughs> And we got shark breath. Shark. Yeah. You can imagine maybe they actually used one of these tunnels. Mmm. Oh, sorry. Sorry. Right. Oh, and you can actually choose the language as well. Really? Yeah, yeah I just saw really? some flags. <laughs> But that's right. the they're clever in Lyon. Oh, they're really clever. <laughs> and um, apparently it was also used during the sorry. And then you put the cards. Oh. And then you get the tickets. That's the wrong one. The wrong one. Cut. <laughs> Try again. What are you doing, Vera? 
So the square, you're going to explain the square's got uh, lots of tents on it so we can't see it. Exactly. So the you have to speak quite loudly. I'm sorry. I'm with deaf people. Yes, and the microphone on the GoPro is not so good. Okay. It is actually part of a limited club or group. No, it is a... Shotgun